I'm not sure if that's just because of popular and stuff. Yeah, I'm not sure. But if it's number I'm recorded now.
actually so excited. Thank you. I'm actually so excited to move here. Me too. See that's the Yeah. Well, we, we claimed it. <laughs> the only thing now I gotta worry about is like having to pay two rent. Which I guess I don't mind. Because that means I can slowly move my stuff in and not have to hire anyone to carry it all in one day. But at the same time, I, can, I won't mind spending uh, two, or saving $2,000 and just move everything at once. So even, even if you have to move everything at once, what the two of us are not okay. The what? Uh, what the two of us, this should be okay, right? Yeah. Also, do you think we're going to be sleeping on the floor for like a week or so? Yeah, I think yeah, we're I also I also want to try one of those uh, roll out things, like what do you call it? But you see it in like Japanese houses a lot. I want to try sleeping like that for a while. Yeah, the ground one. And this time I can actually have a housewarming party too. <laughs> and it won't even have to be in our apartment. It could be on the upper, uh, yeah. My friend says that uh, when he, when uh, we, when I get my place, he will cook for us. <laughs> <laughs> I think I could, I'm going to try uploading this video to uh, YouTube and then just see. Right here in a photo restaurant. Yeah. <laughs> 
When you get to the Morgan Stanley office, you will have a lot of free coffee. But there's other options for you, but it's like hot chocolate or something. Yeah. But they have to get but when I first got to the office, I was actually so happy that there was free coffee. I just like drink five cups a day. <laughs> That's a lot of coffee. Yeah, <laughs> it was not a good idea. That's fully I reduced to like three cups and now I just like one cup. Oh, <laughs> Maybe go back now. They're in the process of Maybe. Well, Plasti, though, uh, for the new, new joiners, they pair us with someone more experienced. So, like, you'll be the main uh, person to contact, but, like, if you don't know how to do it, there's, like, an escalation contact that you can tell. So, basically, the other guy's going to do all my work. <laughs> <laughs> The group that I'm with right now is actually very effective. <laughs> what? Uh, yesterday we had, we had like a meet up, like a drinking party. Yeah. And we were like hoping that some do it get way off here. Oh. oh yeah. Not that we actually know, but we were guessing that most of us are going to last in the year. That's kind of a testament to this thought. Yeah. What, what reason though? Was it like uh, underperforming? No, the reason was that uh, they all thought it was really hard to get into Morgan Stanley. Most yeah. of us felt like we were. Uh, so we're like, we're not qualified. And also, because the training never felt like it would be like anything so far. You learn more yeah, yeah. about yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. Some of them also something about how they like apply to Morgan Stanley. Yeah. I guess this way. I feel like in this way, uh, Morgan Stanley, they don't mind trying out like new grads after just giving you a chance to do it. And after two years, you'll be experienced enough to work for them again. Um, but I do know one guy from my training, training group who got laid off. Did I tell you? Yeah. But his service was not because he was like underperforming, it was just like they had the layoff season and his circumstance was uh, really. What's that? So for the people who are doing development, we don't know if we're actually going to get on. Like for you, your your uh, training group right now? Yeah, because we never did an interview with them. Did everybody else do it? For the production? They did, so they're guaranteed spot already. Uh, yeah, that's right. I don't know why they decided to do that. Do it that way this time. Elena didn't say anything about it. Yeah, maybe I don't want to talk about it. I mean, to be fair, none of us really brought it up. Nobody really brought it up. Oh, okay. It's like, that's how we're deciding to do it. Yeah, that's right.
for real, Mom. The cool thing is, uh, I thought about it. The cool thing about training is that you really need to be okay to do nothing all the time. <laughs> I don't know. Actually, it's when I get bored, I'd rather be doing something. <laughs> I got this kind of too. A lot of people in the uh, industry and stuff, and they're just like watching videos or things. Oh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah. There was a guy in front of me that was playing League of Legends during training. <laughs> <laughs> How does your group seem though? Does everybody seem like pretty cool people? They're all pretty friendly. Are they mostly uh, Montreal natives? Most no. of them are from uh, everywhere else. Mm -hmm. okay. cool. Some well, people are from Montreal. Mm -hmm. Let's see. I actually met one guy in my training. Uh, I ran into oh, one of the guys that was in my training group. And we were talking for a while, and I found out that he's actually from Alberta. It's just that you went to school and like. Yeah. So I'm not the only Western Canada person in my group. There's a lot of foreigners. What? There's a lot of foreigners in my Like, uh, as in, like, not Canadian? Okay. Like your roommate? Your, like your roommate? I guess so. He's been in Canada for like 10 years. Oh, okay. He's from India. He's a girl from like Tunisia. Okay. He came here for school. He's a girl from Jordan. Two people from Canada. Okay. Yeah, yeah actually, that's a big foreign group. Uh, I have a few. Okay. Yeah, I kind of have a few few foreigners too. One guy from India and has been living in the U.S. and just recently came to Montreal. Uh, there's another guy who is Korean. He's there. But that's all I know of Korean. I think everybody else is Canadian. There's people from China. Yeah, guy from Like every every time someone is talking, most people have an accent or something. Yeah. Now everybody in my uh, group speaks pretty. Only a few people that accent really. There's this one guy uh, has like a French accent. Like, Quite a few French speakers in my group. Do you? But some of them like speak like actual French, or not actual French, but like French French, right? Yeah, let's do that French. Yeah.